Hi, clarinets. Uh, welcome to another song towards your blue belt, song number 143, Lowland Gorilla Walk. Uh, this time, not a jump, but a walk. And that's kind of because we're not really jumping from um, low notes up to a high note. We're just playing a lot, a lot of low notes. So what I would do is in your lesson book, write in the notes for this song. Um, a lot of these notes, really, you're not going to be playing until you're playing middle school music. Um, but it's good to learn them now, so that way it's just easy when we get to middle school and high school. So let's go through the notes. First, we have a low F, and we've played that before with one of our, with one of our gorilla jumps. Uh, just remember, low F is thumb, one, two, three, four, five, six, and that pinky key, that's on the top set of two. And it's the bottom one. It sounds like this. Our next note we're going to play is an E, uh, which is the lowest note we can play on a clarinet. And an E is the exact same thing as an F, plus one more finger. So we're going to go thumb, one, two, three, four, five, six. Pinky plus R pinky on this inside key not the outside one the inside one the one closest to the middle of the clarinet here's a low e here's f and then e the only thing I'm doing differently is taking my left pinky and pressing down that key to go from F to E. That was also the first two measures of the song that I just played. And then to keep going, we have Taz, F, G, which we learned from a while ago, Thumb plus all six of our fingers covering the holes. A, like G, except we lift up one finger, so we only have two fingers covering holes. Back down to a G. And then F, which we knew from the beginning. Another E. E, then F, E. F, and we're going to go F, A, two G's, G, another G, and then we end the song with A, F. I highly suggest you write all of these letters in for this song. I know you're like, but Mr. Orlando, your rule is once I get an orange bell, I can't write letters in. These notes are so rare for music for us right now, that I want you to write them in because it's gonna just help you have an easier time recognizing what these notes are. We're not quite used to reading notes this low all the time, quickly, so help yourself out, take it easy on yourself, and write them down. Um, the rhythm, super simple. Half notes, two beats each, ta's right here. The only thing you have to just make sure is, am I pushing down the right fingers to play these low notes, F, E, G, A. The only thing that the rhythm is tricky is right here at the very end. This measure that's blue, the rhythm is ta, ta, ti, ta, ta. Listen to that again. Ta, ta, ti, ta, ta. Ta, ta, ti, ta, ta. Sounds like this. <laughs> And that's the last two measures. Other than that, clarinets, you know these rhythms. You know these notes pretty well. Take your time. Uh, play this song slow. I'm not going to really play this at 108. I'm going to bump this speed down to 80 again. Um, I'll play this song two times. I'll play it once with just the metronome, keeping track of the beat. And then for fun, I'll go back and I'll turn on the background song. So here's Lowland Gorilla Walk.
also, playing low notes takes a lot of air. So make sure you take a big breath whenever you need it. Here's the song one more time, but now I'm going to put on the background music just to have some fun. All right, Clarinets, that was song number 143, Lowland Gorilla Walk. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments, or you can just send me a message. Bye, Clarinets.